this flow is a, more of an advanced flow. Mm -hmm. um, so we'll take yes. a few minutes. Challenge our and, body strength. And... Yes, yes. <laughs> so that's okay if you can't get through it. Just try, and we'll show you some modifications along the way. Yes. Um, Melissa will show those. Yes, so I will. We'll walk you through. Mm -hmm. Okay, so hopefully you've done a little bit of a warm up. Um, just kind of stretch out a little bit with your handles mm -hmm. and kind of, you know, stretch the muscles out before you go into this, mm -hmm. um, this first move. Okay, <laughs> so we're going to stand behind our sling. And now is your sling So I right? drop mine down one notch. So okay. mine is below my waist. Um, so it just depends on kind of how long your legs are, but right. I, I need it to be a little bit lower for this move. I have longer legs than Melissa, so <laughs> I can keep mine up a little bit higher. So I, as you can see the difference between our two um, mm -hmm. slings, mine's up a little bit higher. Mm -hmm. So you can adjust um, once we show you the move, you can come back up and lower it if you need to. Mm -hmm. All right, you're going to stand behind your sling, bring one foot up and just place that heel somewhere in the middle of the sling. Grab your middle handles. Now we're gonna come down to the ground. So the best way to do this is to just lean back a little bit, keep your elbows tucked into your side, and then hop that foot towards the front of your mat and straighten out your arms and bring your bottom down to the ground. Now your foot should slip a little bit forward and it should hook right on the edge of your sling. Okay, so mm -hmm. you got yours? Yep, all, all right. right. So bring the other leg up and place your heel just right next to it. It should just fit right in the edge of the sling there. So again, if your legs, if you feel like you're up off the ground, then you might need to lower your sling. Okay, so I want you right underneath your anchor points. Um, and so just slightly lift your bottom up off the ground and you should just be hanging straight down. Okay, so I want you to lower back down. So what we're gonna start with is just a forward fold stretch. Okay, so I am just gonna pull myself forward Bring my head forward towards my knees. You should feel a good stretch in the back of your legs. Do you feel that, Melissa? I definitely okay. feel that, yes. <laughs> All um, right, so it may not look like much, but... <laughs> definitely. All right, and then you're going to relax back. Mm -hmm. Okay, the next move is you're going to bring your bottom up off the ground and drop the head back behind you. Okay, and then lower back down, nice and slow. Should feel that stretch again and go ahead and give me another forward fold. So you're pulling yourself forward. Good. Don't forget to breathe. Your hands are going to get tired. We're only doing three of these only, or <laughs> only two if you can only hang on for two. Let's do that again. So come up, lower down, forward Woo. fold stretch. Can you do one more? I can do one more. Yeah. That's about it. Only one more. <laughs> All right. So this last one, if you want to split your knees open when you go, that sounds weird, but you'll see what I mean. <laughs> bring it up, knees out, bring those heels in towards your bottom, extend back out and come back down. Woo. Okay. Man. Okay. Let your heels come out. Oh, and yeah. Relax your arms. Forearms. Yeah, and you feel that in the forearms and your yeah. hands. Mm -hmm. So a lot of times when you're just starting this, I've never been able to do more than three. No, no. So if you'd only did two, that's perfectly just fine. One. Just one. <laughs> just one. Just do one. <laughs> okay, work your way up, but three, don't don't worry about going past yeah. three. <laughs> that's a lot. Okay, so let's sit back just a little bit further. So. Your sling is going to be right in front of your face. Mm -hmm. Okay, again, Melissa's a little bit lower, and that's okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to place my feet on the ground and bring your hands um, up in front and then grab onto your sling and twist. Okay, so your elbows are going to be facing out and you're kind of locking your hands mm -hmm. in to yep. the sling. All right, now with this move, you can make it as hard as you want or as easy as you want by where you put your feet. So if you bring your feet in a lot and use your legs, you're going to bring yourself up into that chair position. You're looking through your sling and then you're lowering back down nice and slow. Okay, if you want to make it a little bit harder, you can bring your legs out and, and straighten the legs if you want and lower slow. Okay, so you can do them all different ways. You can do one that way. Next one, walk your legs in. Right. Okay, so we just did two, but we're actually going to do five. We just showed you. That was just demo. So we're That's just, right. Now we got three more, now more to do. Well, I was going to say we have five more to do. Oh, what? Yeah, so we're going to do five. <laughs> All right, All right, let's go. That's our demo. So 
So you pick where your legs go, and we're gonna do five of these, nice and slow and controlled. Okay, so you're gonna pull yourself up, and lower nice and slow. Good job. So that was one, let's do that again. Pull it up, and lower. See, you can do three more, right? I can. Okay, so come up, and lower. Two more. Two more, we got it. All right, up, lower, Woo. good. All right. All right, one more. Up, and lower. Melissa, lower, and I'm gonna do a little bit of a challenge oh, move yeah, and bring me. my legs up <laughs> and Holy down. Cow. Yeah, I can only do one of those, so yeah. All right, but you can do all five of them like that, actually, if you were That would be to. quite impressive, yeah, I'm telling you. not me. Okay, all right, so go ahead, take your sling, and we're just gonna come up to standing. So pull yourself up behind okay. your sling. Mm -hmm. Okay, oh. so now we're gonna go into angel pose. Mm -hmm. And we should probably just demonstrate this a couple ways, a couple different times. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm going to start with the more beginner version, mm -hmm. which I feel is still a little bit advanced. So there you go. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's hard. It's hard either way. I feel like. Okay, so my tip is when you come down, you're going to come down right underneath your anchor points. My elbows are staying bent. And using that core, but a little bit of the legs, throwing the legs up and over, I'm gonna try and catch one leg on the handle and then bring the legs out and down. Hips down, hips up, and then come back around. Okay, so that's a little very bit good. of an mm -hmm. easy way to kind yeah. of get that one leg up there if you can. It might not look very pretty, <laughs> And your legs might flop down ten. to the ground, that's okay. Mm -hmm. Any way you can get that leg wrapped around mm -hmm. is a good start. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay? And then once you get past that and you get a little more core strength, then we can flip both legs up and over. If you need to give, give yourself a little hop, Here, do that. I'll show. So come down directly underneath. Give yourself a little hop and a kick. Hop and then Drop. straighten out. Mm -hmm. All right? Nice, and then come down. So on, when you come back down, you wanna try and go nice and slow and controlled. Mm -hmm. Try and use those uh, abs and the core yes, to lower. Yeah, definitely a lot. But if more. not, mm -hmm. if you don't have that, you just get those legs down. Get it out, <laughs> any way you can. Okay, <laughs> so once we go upside down and we're in that angel pose, we're gonna come into a pike mm -hmm. uh, three times. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So follow along, you can watch first and then go ahead and try it yourself. Okay, so All right. let's come down, elbows bent. I found that's the easiest way to get those legs over. If you extend the arms, it's a little bit harder to get your legs right. up and over. Mm -hmm. Okay, so come down right under those anchor points. Bring the legs up, right at the ankles, straighten out, look up. Bring the bottom up, hips up, come into that pike. And then we're gonna straighten out again. It's okay if you're swinging a little bit. <laughs> Come into that pike. One more time. Into angel. Good. And now we're gonna bring the legs around and down to the ground. Ooh. Good job. <laughs> All right. Oh my nice. Gosh. Yeah, that's so good. <laughs> so good. All right. Again, if your legs just flop down to the ground, that's okay. Every time you do it, just try a little bit to slow that. Yes. That yes. just bent down a mm -hmm. little bit. Oh, all right. Yeah. So, okay. And now I think we're done. That we're done. That was it for today. So add that into any of your workouts for a Keep little practicing. Different. Yeah, you'll just get stronger every time. If you can only do a couple, just do a couple, but just yeah. kind of progress up and you'll see yourself getting stronger. Yeah. It's very exciting. Have fun. Yeah. All right. Thanks for following along. Thanks. All right. Bye. <laughs>